name is Shola Adeiga. I'm the founder and CEO of Credit Pro Business Support Services Limited. I'm a graduate of computer science. I'm a chartered accountant. I'm a fellow of the Institute of Credit Administration of Nigeria. Uh, I've developed solutions in different industries such as manufacturing, agri, transportation, and now, you know, credit. I started Credit Pro in 2019 out of the vision to solve the problem many small businesses face in this part of Nigeria. We have done for over three years. We've provided solutions in working capital, you know, targeted as small scale businesses. One of the problems faced by small businesses in this part of the world and generally in sub Saharan African countries is access to finance. So you see guys with very great ideas, but they find it difficult to access credit from the big commercial banks in the country. So we felt you know this potentially a very big opportunity for us by solving this problem and creating value for ourselves from it. We have disbursed over 4 billion era in working capital. We have over about 1,000 you know, small business owners that have accessed credit one way or the other from our, you know, from our business. We, okay, statistics shows that 96% of all businesses in Nigeria are actually small businesses, contributing about 48% to the GDP and about 17.1 of them are medium, small and medium scale businesses. We have about 41 million small business owners in Nigeria today and then the last CBN report showed that there is a funding gap of about 600 billion in this sector. Unfortunately, despite the contribution of this sector to the Nigerian GDP, only 1% of the total credit in, the, in a particular year goes to them. So this is a misnomer. So if we really want the SME sector to be productive, there must be access to creative funding for that sector. And what is Credit Pro interested in doing? We want to reduce that funding gap possibly by 20% in the next five years. One thing that is peculiar to commercial bank is that they create off-the-shelf credit products you know, for businesses. So what does that mean? Mr. A needs a credit, Mr. B needs a credit. Irrespective of the cash flow pattern of these guys, they all go to the bank and take the same credit. So in the course of repayment, to realize they are challenging because those credits are not customized to suit their, their cash flow pattern. So what we do at Credit Pro is to sit down with these small businesses, analyze their cash flow pattern, educate them on you know the kind of loan they actually need and you know we customize loans for them and we've made a lot of sources out of this so this is what the banks will not do that we are doing this is our objective and this is why credit pool was set up to create customized working capital products that can be assessed by small scale businesses to solve their working capital needs. So the beauty of our model is that we sit with you, consult with you, and try to suggest a working capital product that matches your business model or matches your cash flow pattern. We've done this for the past three years. We have a work committed team of young people. We have guys that you know are passionate about supporting small businesses and we've won awards. We've increased our balance sheet, we've increased our number of staff, we've made each success in the last three years with good profitability also to show for it. We need to scale this business. Our vision is not just to operate in Nigeria. The problem is global, but we want to operate in sub-Saharan Africa. So in Nigeria, we have to want to operate in Ghana, we want to operate in Kenya, we want to operate in Uganda. After all, the small businesses in these countries actually have similar problems as we have in Nigeria. So we need $5 million and what for? We want to channel it into digitizing our processes, building infrastructure for the business, and into scaling to other African countries. And more importantly, we need working capital, we need to increase our portfolio size. It is that our model is profitable. We've covered our overhead, we've paid our investors back. There is no issue, you know, as per the profitability of the business. So we've scaled this business in the last three years in multiple folds using by bootstrapping and using funds from individual investors. 
at this point, we think we need to scale. And we need to scale very well outside the shores of this country. Help reduce poverty by empowering small businesses in this part of the world. And let's solve real problems and create wealth. Thank you.